Ah. Almost had the stream muted, I think. Let's test the audio real quick. Hell yeah. Well, as exciting <clears throat> as Nero and Devil Trigger is, today we bury the light. And I'm so ready. I guarantee that sounded like shit, but it was worth it to me. <laughs> All right. Well, <clears throat> I think that's about enough lollygagging. I have done a little bit <clears throat> of uh, main campaign, but that's not what we're here for today. That's definitely not what we're here for. We are absolutely here for the boy. The boy. The one. The only. Virgil. I haven't loaded him up. I haven't seen how he plays. I mean, he's Virgil, so I know he plays like Virgil. But I have not touched him. I have kept cold for the last few days. Just Let's go. A Haven't seen this. Haven't seen these cutscenes. What is it? You hungry? <laughs> well, you're in luck now, guess. Food's ready. Kitty A always makes too much. Hope you like loud talkers too, cause you got a pair of those upstairs. You see something you like? You a demon. Nero, the food's getting cold. Trillian, get back inside now! <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. I'm gonna check sound back over for a second. Sounds great. That, that little, that little hum of Fairy the Light. Oh! Cutting forward. Here it comes! <laughs> oh, that's super good. Yep, and that's about as much pre-explanation as we get, because who cares? 
Virgil's here. That's all we need. Okay. Yeah, they just drop us in, of course, because this is Virgil mode. We don't get proper story. That's fine. Um, I'm seeing a ridiculous level of um, control over the clone on, on the, over the doppelganger on the side. So that's kind of nuts. Uh, yeah, again, I haven't actually really gone too far into Virgil at all. I played I, obviously I played him in, in four SE. Um, but I don't really know what he's been changed to, to in this one. So, yeah. Um, let's just hit some basic buttons for now and see what happens. Oh, Alright, what do you have right now? Yeah, move, provocation, yeah. Uh, slide roll. Yeah, of course. Kick, jump, trick up. Yeah, air trick. Or a circle. If multiple enemies are marked, choose the enemy to teleport to with. Grim trick. Yeah. Uh, doppelganger. Or up? Interesting. Making his movements, he can alter the speed at which he acts. To speed up or slow down. That is a remarkable level of control, actually. <laughs> and up to return to normal. Interesting. Dismiss the clone. Sin DT. And of course, his uh, his true his true devil trigger form. Depletes the SDT gauge to raise attack, defense, movement speed, and restore vitality. Of course, uh, accumulate. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. World of V. Eh? World of V. Use the power of the Yamato to cleave devil from man, allowing V and his minions to unleash a devastating attack and restores vitality on use. Um, R1 plus rotate. Uh, consumes concentration gauge. Like the whole gauge? Defeated enemies will drop or green orbs with greater frequency. So you can get health back with that. Okay. Um, consumes concentration gauge. Like the whole gauge? That makes sense. So, R1, rotate the left stick plus circle. Oh, I did it! Interesting. We both spring from the same parts. <laughs> oh, that's good. What else we got? So for the Yamato, yeah, we've, we've obviously not every one of these is filled yet. So we have a four hit combo. We have in the in mid air. We have judgment cut. Yes. Unsheath your sword with blinding speed and unleash a whirlwind of slashes. This can be used after, after most Yamato skills. Increase the attack power by pressing triangle at the right time. Hold and release. And release when the scabbard sparkles to increase power. Increase the attack power by releasing at the right time. When in Sin DT, this attack can hit it up to three enemies at once. Interesting. So, ba, 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 ba. Air. Ba, ba, ba. And if I recall, do I have his... No, I do not have his delay yet. That makes sense. Um, so... Out of my way. Don't know. Out of my way. Don't know. Cool. Makes sense. Oh. So, we have the judgment cut. Hold and release from the scabbard's bar close. After most Yamato skills, increase the, the attack power. Okay. Out of my way. Don't move. Is there a a moment I'm waiting for on this? Out of my way. Okay. Um, upper slash. Yes, of course. The launcher. We cool. Um, yes, that's all he's got there for now. Now, of course, we also have Beowulf. Classic. Yeah. 
as you can see, I saved quite a bit of uh, the bonus of uh, red orbs you get at the start of the game because I wanted to spend them all on Virgil. I spent a little bit on Nero, but yeah, I mostly wanted to save these for Virgil. Um, so Beowulf combo, Starfall. Focus upon an enemy from midair and dive down. Yeah, so just 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 to the dive kick, of course. And then lunar phase. So dive kick and lunar phase. Cool. Those go a lot faster than they remember than I remember them going. Um Okay. Let's see. Miracle Edge. Miracle Edge. Oh. So instead of the Force Edge. Yeah. I've seen a bit of this. So you have that. So we have the Stinger. Yeah. Yeah, we have the Stinger. Yeah, so we have the Stinger, we have the Helmbreaker, of course, and we have High Time. Yeah, yeah. Blast. Get lost. <laughs> uh, it appears that's everything we have right now. It appears so. Yeah, so. Cool. Oh god, he doesn't even have basic run yet. Because I haven't bought it. Kick jump near the wall, of course. Yeah, he doesn't even have a basic run yet. <laughs> when a barrier blocks off your path. Yeah, I know. Don't move. Let that concentration gauge fill. Lock on, of course. Targeting mirror also indicates how much help the enemy has left. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Extra health, it's not too long. Just what I want. Horizontally, two of the eight attacks. Low attacks can be also can also be made with a jump. But that's not Virgil's style. There we go. God, bloody Virgil. Ooh. Sight. Hey, yeah, and they skip us down here. <laughs> there we go. That's the shit I like.
All right, now let's go get our ass kicked by Urizen. Because that's the flow. Nefarious usurper. Oh, I, I de-summoned him. Okay, down de-summons him. That's good to know. Good to learn these things in the fight I have to lose. I mean, fair. That's fair. There we go. Yeah, that shit looks good. Awesome. B, uh, yeah, that's fair. Give me those orbs. Yeah, it's a good load screen. And it's already done! Because PS5 is ridiculous. Be the main mission manual flying as Virgil. Use red orbs. Alright, now, are you ready for a significant amount of labbing to happen? Because that's what's about to happen. <laughs> First off, speed. We need that sprint. Uh, trick dodge while on the ground. Yes, actually. Let's try that out. It's I can load into the void and try these things very quickly now because the loading times aren't ridiculous. While on the ground. Trick dodge. Can I not go left or right? Isn't that what this is for? Oh! Well, not locked on. I see. Got it. That makes sense. Oops. Yes, I would very much like that. Trick down. Yeah, so you can go backwards. So good news, the PS4, or the PS5 actually has a really good chat overlay, so I can actually read what you're saying. What you saying? What you are saying? You can only you can only target your teleport if you aren't targeted. Yeah, cool. Uh, that's actually really nice that I can actually see comments without. Yeah. So trick down. Basic shit, but we'll hit try anyways. A lot of these moves are quite expensive. I'm noticing that immediately. Like, way more expensive than the Neros are. So, back. Oh, back to forward. Interesting that it wouldn't just be back. But I'm into it. And then I can... Okay, you can only do that. You can only teleport in from a certain distance. Closer. Got it. Okay, so yeah, let's grab that. That seems incredibly useful. Okay, I'm gonna, like, blow through his orbs if I get all these main ones immediately. This is very exciting, the block, but, like... Well, okay, we can try it. We can try it, but, like, I gotta, I gotta be conservative with these orbs right now. So, while concentration is, is one or higher, the enemy is at level two or higher, decreases the concentration gauge. If it's at level 2 or higher, he will parry with finesse. Okay, so let's switch you on so that you will attack. So I get concentration to 1. Let's see that one first. Yeah, okay, hit me. Okay, so that's a basic block. Let's get concentration higher. That, get it up to level two. Let's see that parry. Kind of confused. That didn't look like much of a parry. Maybe it has to be higher. 
Let's just get it to max and see what that looks like. Huh. Didn't really look like a parry. Maybe it has to be per maybe it actually I can't hold it. Maybe it has to be frame perfect. Let's give that a shot. That's up to level two. No, that's fine. Either way, might be something I'm missing. Ooh, I can look into that later. Okay, I should really be focusing on the actual combos right now. So let's let's get in there. Uh, so of course I need uh, combo B. That's important. Let's just grab two of these and roll. That's important. That's very important. Let's grab that too. Rapid Slash is cheap, so let's grab that. Oh yeah, yeah, we need that. Definitely gonna want that. Let's hit. Let's uh. Let's actually hit try so we can roll through a couple of these. I remember these moves, but it's still good to roll through them. So, to start. We that's not it. All right, because I don't have the the follow up uppercut, the actual full on uppercut yet. Kind of missed, but that's fine. Yeah, good shit. Now for the other ones, it was so we have da da pause da 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 pause. Sorry, wait, it was saying something about Cindy T. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, fire more blade. When in Cindy T, you'll fire more blades and can strike to fall. Press triangle to follow up with additional strikes. Okay. Oh yeah, there was a sword. That's that's a nice little touch, actually. So then, but but but. Pretty sure you can follow that up. You can keep matching that. Yeah. That's that. That's important. So, when in Cindy T, the finishing blow will strike an even larger area. That makes sense. Let me give something a shot. I wanna. But, but, but. Yeah, there we go. There. Uh, is that everything I bought so far? If I, if I got everything on my, my brain pan? I think so. Yeah. back. Yes. Don't forget that, because now that's in my brain and I, I'm going to end up using it. So, good. Rising Star. Yeah, I really need that. I really, really need that. Oh, that's after the dash. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Yeah, I remember that. Um... In midair... Where's just the follow-up? Judgment cut end. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's good shit. Um, where's the actual uppercut? Or is, is, am I forgetting? Is it, is it actually, is the uppercut only on this? Well, either way. No, is it? Press and hold triangle. Oh, no, that, that's the uppercut. Okay, that makes sense. And then we want this, of course. That's cheap, so let's also get this. 
Definitely want to fill out that base move set. You know, I think I think these last two. What is this? Oh. I don't understand what that was. Slash at the area before you with tremendous speed, cleaving the air itself and drawing enemies toward you. Oh, oh, it's pulling them in. That's okay. You can come in as much as you want. Um, man, I actually really appreciate that overlay. It doesn't show up on the stream, but it pops a little box into the corner so I can see the comment without, like, taking up half the screen. Um, it's actually really nice. Uh, so yeah, let's, 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 let's take this. I said, I said, I said, video game. I said, let's take this. Let's try first. So, the last thing I got was, of course... Yeah, the rising star, so hold hold it while it connects. And then this is upper slash. Upper slash two. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. So then there's that, and then there's also this. Cool. So just to refresh, that was that, and then I have the second upper slash. And then I also have this. Definitely want that. We can leave these two for now, because, you know, expensive. Uh, God! These numbers. They are not getting around. Uh, let's see. Spiral blades. Yeah, we should, we should get these. We should get these two at least. So we want to get this one where you hold it down. I am holding. I am indeed holding. Uh, consumes DT gauge when performed. Oh! Got it. Needs a DT. Let's void it up real quick. Um, yeah. Cool. So, so basically, a thing I'm getting is that if I hit the button at the right time, instead of this, I can get a perfect follow-up where it's mid-combo. Like that. Yeah. That wasn't exactly it, but still. Yeah, that's good to have around. That's about to get a confrontation is to do nothing near an enemy new inputs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, just kind of walk around them, maybe trick a little. Um. Storm blades. Yeah, another good option. So let's try that out. Oh yeah, just standing still. Yeah. I'm not really noticing it raising slower or less when I'm walking as opposed to not walking, actually. It looks about the same. Let's empty it. Taking my time. No lock on. 
Ah, okay. Let's see. Just go near him first, and then we'll just stand. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So it takes about fifteen seconds of just standing to fill. Let's test the R1 and letting it fill while I am walking around near him. I want to see if it's what the time difference is. So let me go near him and let me walk. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twelve. Rough okay, so it's like a five second difference. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. So back and hold, and it'll be on him. That's all good shit, yeah. Okay, so it's about a five second difference. Um, in terms of building it, might still need to kind of be close and just dodging, but still. As opposed as to not get hit. Uh, so let's do that. What is this one? Oh yeah, those. I remember that. So we want the delay combo for sure. Starfall two. Lunar phase two. Beast uppercut? Yeah. Let's let's go try on that one. There we go. And then, on the ground. <laughs> Bam! Definitely learn that. Rising Dragoon. Yeah, that's the that's the full uppercut. Flush. Yeah. Kick 13. Good old kick 13. When in Sin DT, the kicks are further empowered in an even greater number. Hell on Earth. Uh oh. Oh, oh, that's new. Ooh! I would like to try that very quickly. I would I would like to see that. While in Cindy T, or while Cindy T gauge is max, and concentration is at level 2, yeah, lots of requirements. Uh, forward, then triangle square, or triangle circle. So basically, we get, well, concentration is already up there. Build that. Cool. So while Cindy T gauge is maxed, or concentration is at level 2, and, no, sorry, not, not or, and. Man, understanding. R one plus forward. Maybe it is actually. I have to be in it. Let's give it a shot. 
That's R1. What am I doing wrong? Hmm. All the gauges is maxed. Concentration's at level 3. What exactly is not coming out here? Oh, I'm an idiot. It's for fucking Beowulf. Duh. Rest in peace. Wow! <laughs> now I Wowza! That's fucking cool. So that's all the all that stuff. I'm gonna full concentration. Not supposed to be easy. You're supposed to both attacks. Uh, supposed to whiff, to not whiff attack. Dodge perfection. The immaculate as the fight goes on. The initial standing boost just gives you the initial start. Yeah, that makes sense. Um. I just noticed my my uh, amounts, so I should definitely put some into this. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. Helmbreaker level two. Million stab. Yes, actually, I would like that. That and round trip seem like good investments right now for the early. Um, so yeah, million stab. Yeah, round trip is a good all-purpose helpful tool, so I'm, I may grab that. Let's go into try so that I can try these last three. Right, let me check that again. That is, it's double double pause. Okay. Yeah, I remember that. Clean cut. Clean cut. Good. Uh, the second one I bought was. What was it again? Yeah, it was just the million stab. Yeah, there we go. And that'll stay out during that too, yeah. Cool. Yeah. Uh Round trip seems like just a good investment in general, even though it's a little pricey, but I think it's worth it. Um, now, we're getting lower on the end of what we have, so stronger, faster, and farther reaching. I think that's actually a pretty good investment. Yeah, we're com coming up on the end of our, uh, our big expenditures. Um... Beowulf still a little light. Lunar phase could be, oh, that's that's expensive though. Uh, Rising dragon, we we know about that. Kick thirteen. I could blow almost everything I have left on kick thirteen. <laughs> I I mean that would be that's tempting, but ooh. Uh, you know what? Actually, I'm thinking is a smarter investment. Uh, since we're at the point in the game where I'm still kind of lacking on. These resources, I think I should grab a bunch of these. I think that I think I can't go wrong there. Yeah. Can't go wrong with more DT. 
No, not done. Uh, so we can afford, like, one more thing. What's it gonna be? Let's see. What the hell can I actually even afford at this point? Might be a better dive kick. That might be all I have, actually. Think I'm going with a better dive kick. Yeah. Alright. I think that's about everything I can afford for now. I think that's a good little moveset we got there. Okay. Alright. I have a uh, Aurora, a Blue Orb Guide, a Blord Guide, also a Prorb Guide. Um, I have done the first couple levels as Nero, so I don't have to worry about anything until I pass at least level... Th uh, I think it's level 4. Um, but, uh, yeah. For now. Trick up. Air trick. Yeah. In concentration, no reason to flee. Perform an air trick or an attack. Increasing the power of your own. Running, getting hit, or missing an attack off that concentration. Trick up. Teleport to a spot above you. Air trick. Closing any target of an enemy. <laughs> White orbs. Oh wow, I never picked one up. Yeah, because I haven't played as V yet, so I haven't technically gotten to see these. There we go. I think that was a pretty nice start. That's fair. <laughs> I, of course, got greedy, and spoke too soon, and got walloped by a tentacle. That's very on brand for me. Again! Actually, you know what? I never, I never did any, any practice in the void with the, uh, the doppelganger. I'll do that after this level. I, because I should, I should get some time in and kind of figure out the ins and outs of that. Wow, that was some damage. Oh, okay, yeah. Cool, now it's actually telling me about this. When DT is at level 3 or higher, press L1 or up to summon the clone. 
and the Zen effects based on what you do. I can press L1 or down to send him away. Control the speed at which he reacts. Normal, haste, so speed up, and then do what I do slower. That's a remarkable level of control, actually. Uh, Sin DT, there's a new gauge above the DT gauge, Sin DT, fill this gauge, transfer, yeah. Hold L1 with a full SD, yeah. True Sin DT. You gain increased strength, defense, movement speed, as well as any enhanced techniques. Makes sense. World of the- oh yeah. Ability heals on use and increases the chance that you'll see Bruno or the enemy. Shit. Ah! That's fine. Thanks, Kaneko. Took a lot of hits on that, but you know, I'm learning. Still got an S. Let's, uh, let, well, first off, I just got a lot more points, so let's see if there's anything I can grab. Um,. Flush, Rising Dragoon, Stinger 2. Drive wouldn't be the worst, actually. Wouldn't mind that. Back to forward, makes sense. At a, slow, a slower rate. Oh yeah, that's that's actually super good. Um, might leave that for now, actually. Uh, let's let's just go into try for a minute so I can do some practice with the clone because I'm kind of curious. I I bought I did buy an extra thing actually. What was it? I bought I bought drive. Yeah. Back to forward. Go to hell. Go to hell. Go to hell. No charge on that? Hell. That's fine. Okay, so. So normal pace. Yeah, it's infinite, so he's not going to go out. So let's try using the regular. So it'll make you want to go slower. Go slower than me. Yeah. Now I want you to do it faster. Oh god, that's not just fast. He's basically in time with me. Like, like, there's obviously a slight delay, but he might as well be attacking with me.
Yeah, that's crazy. Doppelganger are very cool. Let's mess around with Cindy T. Straight in. All right. Oh, I should unplug that. There we go. Don't quite need that booming. Virgil hates little kids. It's not even wrong, actually. In case anyone was wondering, uh, the game is 4K60 right now. It's, I'm not running ray tracing. Yes. And here comes those beats. Oh, the way the song plays out is really good. Mo Virgil! Virgil! You can make that jump. Concentration stays between fights? I would not have expected that, actually. I would have expected that to drain. Or just empty after a fight, actually. I guess he's just always motivated. Hi!
Yeah, that's the shit. That's the dodge that I'm looking for. So release R1 and dodge. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. That's kind of weird. I got like hung up on the wall. Oh! The lack of cutscenes is so shocking. It's so fast. Hey. I guess that's kind of a cutscene. I love you. What the fuck is this? This is beneath me. Yeah, I know. Oh, the sheath is just so satisfying. Did I actually buy the the sword move that makes them rotate around them? Did I actually do that? 
Yeah, I did. Back. Hold back. Got it. It's actually wild to me that concentration stays between fights. I didn't know that. Finally. He's so spiteful of this little thing. Fuck, I want to deal with this shit. I don't want to deal with this shit. Let me go back to reading poetry and eating pizza when Dante's not looking. Don't let him know. I already did this one, but let's do it just for just cause for funsies. Sure, why not? I don't think I've ever used these. Man, that looks pretty. Well, uh, ugly pretty, but still. I love how that looks. I love Beowulf because it it's it's so uncharacteristically Virgil. <laughs> like 
this prim and proper, stay at a distance, cut you up into pieces, dude. Just like, I'm gonna beat the shit out of you now. I'm done with your shit. I'm going to kick your face in. guys win. Got it. Ah. Ah. It is very cool to have this man's in this video game. Some trailers will have their own divinity statues. You can trade. Really? Oh, the, the, are they implying that Nico's not in the van because she wouldn't be, like, serving Virgil? Yes, they are implying that Nico's not in the van. Okay. Void Slash. This seems very interesting, actually. Seems very interesting. Oh, there's overdrive. That's the ch that's where the charge comes in. Okay, that makes sense. Blistering blades. Forward hold release, then back and forward. I think these would both be nice, actually. I think I think bolstering my blades would be good. Let's just hit try on this so I can try those out. So I, so let me internalize this now that I have the full blade op set of options. Hold on me. Up on you. Oh, to, to blast forward. That makes sense. Arrows go forward. Swords go forward. Hold forward. Back. Goes on you. Forward on you. Back on you. And then let's internalize the back forward. Oh. 
Cool. So, refresh on you. Oh, I did to dispel you. So, on you, forward. Hold on me. That's a good little upgrade there. All right, Goliath. I am very curious to see how much I fuck up trying to keep my concentration up. The trick did not help me there. I get up. Oh, I think because I used it, I can't. That's fair. Yeah, that's a lot of iframes. That's a frankly ridiculous amount of iframes. Ah! I really thought I could chip his last health before he got me in. I could not. That's fine. Oh, <laughs> I shot the trick sword at him to warp to him, and apparently that pixel was enough. He didn't even teleport like he was just dead. That's great.
Thank you for the orbs. Thank you for the this bounty of orbs. The void slash sounds like it would be cool. So back to forward. Pulls everyone in. Yeah, I like that. I think that's a really cool move. Does he have a second Void Slash thing? No, he does not. Grim trick, yeah. So, void slash. That's super cool. Grim point. Yes. Sometimes he'll, like, re receive a late input and turn around in the middle of his sheathing animation during, like, the victory bit, and it upsets me deeply because I want him to look cool. And instead he just kind of turns around like a jackass. So this is the last level I redid with Nero, so after this level I will be blue and purple orb hunting, so that'll be fun. Yeah, that's a huge difference. Sorry, I'm forgetting how to change lock-on. This is becoming an issue. Listen to listen to Barry the Light in the background for a moment while I remember that. Oh, it's clicking. Of course. Why would it be anything else? Of course.
Yeah, there we go. Now it's a lot better. Grim Grip. Yeah. Standing in the right spots. There we go. Yeah, yeah, I know. Had a big fuck up on that fight, but that's fine. I'm understanding the flow. Man, I love this controller. It feels so good. That looks breakable. What's up, guys?
Oh, that's a good feeling. Don't let any impulses escape. Any impulses. I don't know why that's the voice. That's fair. Oh, he doesn't need a double jump because he has that air trick. Uh, actually, there's not a lot of directional control on that. Yeah, you're kind of like throwing away your, your jump momentum on that. That's fine. Oh wow. Well then. I like that they put the, the the truck already there because the idea of Virgil picking up a phone and like pressing buttons is ridiculous. Deep st oh sorry, I, I don't think I paid much attention to this. What is this? Deep Stinger. Whoa! 
Oh, 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 oh my god, it's still going! Same same requirements while Cindy T is either active or while in it. I want to try that real quick. Okay, let's try that. There goes. Wow. Even like those thick Bugs Bunny trails too. So, okay, so that's something I need to keep in mind. It's not just while it's maxed, it's you're spending the bar. There is no escape. Let's try it out. Holy shit! Wow, that's cool. Yeah, Judgment Con End is, of course, another super important one. It's the, so it's the, it's the same principle. So, basically, he has, like, a crazy ender for all three of his weapons. And they're all the same input, too, so you can keep them in mind easy. Let's try that out. I just want to see it. Man, that Kaneko design looks fucking perfect all, even all these years later. Wait a minute. What are Virgil's taunts? I'm curious. Have you decided which one of you will die first? That's the base. Oh, can I not build up style while I'm while I'm practicing? I can't look at the other taunts. Build that up again. You shall die. It's so good. It's so good. Separating doppelganger and and his regular devil trigger like that to to have both, like it's so good.
Got it. Okay. Um, what did I actually... Did I actually buy anything on this particular visit to the store? I feel like I might not have. Um, okay. So, the next level is one that I haven't done on Special Edition yet. It's V's first level, but it'll be with Virgil, of course. Um, so I now have my orb guide open. I'm gonna casually remind myself where the first orb is. So the pr first purple's, like, basically impossible to miss, because it's, like, positioned in an open room because they want you to see it so that you understand that you have to collect them. Um, so... From what I'm seeing, it looks like the... Oh, okay. And then the blue orb would be there. He runs all the way down there, past that gate. And he does that fight. He goes up and grabs that. And then the next orb is... I'm just trying to internalize some of this. How do I even get into that room? Because there's a room that only breaks if you use V's big, big, chonky fella. And I wonder how you get in there with Virgil. Maybe the wall's just already busted. But anyways, let's, uh, let's, let's, let's forge on ahead. Oh, right! I got so wrapped up in, in the upgrading there that I didn't, forgot that I hadn't done the boss yet. Ah, uh, walked away. Oh, wait, they're still hitting him. Or her. these S's. Just can't handle them. Um. Kick 13 would be pretty nice. Overdrive is also pretty nice.
Is there anything in here that would be particularly helpful right now? Trigger Heart in general. You know what? I kind of want Trigger Heart. Let's save. Let's save for Trigger Heart, because Trigger Heart seems like it's just incredibly good no matter what. Like, in all contexts, it's just good. So we're going to get some orbs in this level. God, I didn't even fucking see what the last thing said. I, it, I think it was being advisory for tricks. I love him so much. Plays like a dream. Gotta use that round trip more. Come on. There we go. That felt good. <laughs> That was a rush. Hey! Cool. So, uh... Well, maybe I shouldn't spoil it. All I'll say is that uh, they did do some modifications to the end of this game when you're playing as Virgil. And they make me very happy. So there is a purple orb. Actually, I can see it on screen. It's way over there. Um, very close by. Is that another? Is that, a, is that a, Yeah, it is. I saw you. I saw you thanks to the glorious 4K.
death. Go. That's number one. And now there's one in the back alley. There's one in the broken building room. I gotta, I gotta remember. This will be more useful later on in the game when the enemies are tougher. But like, I have to remember to spend my sin. I have to spend my uh, my DT to get my sin DT up before fights, so that I have it as an option if I want it. Just like I did with Dante. Oh, the, the, it's already it's already busted open. There you go. That answers that question. That's probably because I have more moves than I did with Nero at this point in the game, but I feel like I'm just getting S's like crazy. Don't forget about the one upstairs, Devin. You're not that stupid. And that's another health book piece, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. Hell yeah. So let me pause for a second and take a look at the video a little more. So there's the one upstairs. And then you can run into the alley down below. Get another Nidhug piece. Run back through. And then you'll go through that fight. Then you'll use a Nidhug hatchling on that back area. There's one up there. And there's also one upstairs for a secret mission. Okay, got it. So I need you. Now where do you go? He's so tired. What the fuck do I do with this? But he would never say fuck. He would never say fuck. Virgil would never say the fuck word.
Oh. Yeah, this whole extra style of game, it's just so much fun. Like he, like he detests that it's in his pocket. Just absolutely seething. There we go. That's still doable. I was like, how are you gonna do that? Virgil's like kind of slower. But no, that's doable. Slower in base movement, at least. He's a lot faster than the other characters when he's fighting. Did I absolutely get the one in the alley? I'm kind of like paranoid now. Yeah, I got it. Okay. So let me check. The thing, where is the next one I have to worry about? The next fragment is... It's actually in the next mission. But let me try and refresh my memory on where that is. So it's in the little cargo area. You jump down there. Then you go underneath and you get that. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, we don't have to worry about that for a bit. This, this wall is blown open. Oh, is Nidhogg up ahead? I'm curious what that fight's like with Virgil.
that little smirk. So, there was a bit in there where I, like, did one of these. I think it might even might have even been, like, one of the, like, it was somewhere, might have been that. I think I did, I did like, one of those uh, uppercuts. And I totally, in the middle of Sin DT, uh, I accidentally parried that dude's hit. I didn't even mean to, I just powered through it. Oh my god. The physics. They're losing it. Um, and yeah, it, it, it felt super good. I love that I can do that. It's not a move that you should do because, like, I kind of powered through it as opposed to actually needing to get it, but you know. I would very much like Trigger Heart. I'd very much like Trigger Heart. Let's get me, let's get myself some Trigger Heart. Both the SDT and the DT gauge deplete at a slower rate. Excellent. Lunar Phase 2. Not the, not the worst investment, actually. A better Lunar Phase. So it's Nidhogg time, right? I never really liked this boss, <laughs> originally. Let's see if he's better with Virgil. I like this music, though. Music's cool. Bad trick. I always liked Nidhogg's music more than I liked the boss. I think this is a lot better with Virgil though, actually. Ah! I gotta build up my concentration. Can't get that concentration out. Ah! Oh, 
think he's gonna get me. Yeah, he's gonna get me. I'm, I'm missing like crazy. Yeah, that's fair. Learn the fight. Gotta relearn an entire new strategy because he obviously has to be fought a little differently now. That was weird, I was like stuck in a trick. Build that concentration so I can even do damage. Ah! He can just like jump into the air and knock me out of the out of the air with that thing. It's rough.
Yeah. Still not exactly optimal performance, but I got him. That's an interesting boss for Virgil. Yeah, actually. Bring that into the table. So just to remind myself of the next orb in the area where I'm coming down into those docks. Not, not even docks, but coming down there. And then you go downstairs, and then you go back around, and then you go through there for the secret mission. Uh, and then up the little scaffolding. Okay, got it. Okay, that should be fun. Hell yeah. Virgil using like super cool moves to like break a box of orbs or like a little crystal of orbs is really funny to me. It's just so beneath him. What's my charge level at? Pretty good. Oh, you. Sir, could you could you let me help my fight? Oh
Oh. I gotta use that more often. Because this seems really good. So. Down here. And then over this way will lead to a secret mission. Let's do that secret mission now. <laughs> okay. Without taking a hit. Okay. Might take a few tries. That's alright. We got this. Ah! I was trying to judgment cut and I fucked it up. Okay, that move is interesting, but dangerous in this context. But it might not be if I can figure out how to make it work. Big damage. 
That's a really good way to abuse iframes to get a bunch of damage in without, um, you know, taking a hit. There we go. I didn't even have to abuse the V thing. Oh cool, I didn't realize I was actually getting another right there. Uh, okay. What's the next one after this, after this mission? Let's see. So the without injury one, and then... There's a prorb coming up in this room. There is one above where V would normally enter. Okay. And then after that is the next mission, so don't worry. Mission 8. Wait, Mission 8? Oh! Oh, shit. This will be our last collectible for a bit, actually. Oh, yeah, right. There. Well, one of the next missions is a boss, so... Makes sense. Uh... Let's go back for a second. I haven't been utilizing the trick back. I should be doing that. Hold on. Oh. Yeah, so trick up, air trick. Trick dodge. Back to forward, trick down. Right. Oh, that's not what I wanted at all. Okay. Yeah, I should be utilizing these. They're there for a reason. Dodge. 
yeah. Uh, so no more trigger. World of the. Ow. I know, I know. You're very menacing. Oh, hi! Ow. Read that in a second. Woo! Okay. What did that play? Remind that for air combo finishes, homebreaker and lunar phase are better. Yeah, that makes sense. Wait, you can do that mid-air? You can do an air stinger? I didn't realize that. That looks like they're really helpful. I can already see the purple view. Gotcha. And that's the last collectible until mission 8. Would you go away? Ah, crap. How do I get up there with Virgil? Can I? Yeah, yeah, here we go. Wait, no, I actually don't want to go in there just yet. Is Have I got everything in this room? I think I might have, actually. Yeah, I think so. Okay. Virgil, that's a wall. It's okay. Yeah, that does a ton of damage.
Well, you're not wrong. <laughs> you're not wrong about that advice. Ooh. occurred to me that since there's three weapons, I can always access either moveset at any point. Since both weapons, since both are active. I love how the music stops at A to be like, hey, can you make it? I've been underappreciating Miracle Edge, I think. Miracle Edge is very good. Oh, it's horse time! It's horsey time! I would like red 13. Red, red, red 13. <laughs> kick 13. Uh, I would like kick 13 very much. Red 13. Was it back forward? Is that what it is? Yes, it is. Got it. And apparently those kicks are even dumber when you're in Sin DT. Hey! wrong. Dog's all wrong. I am getting Virgil's rhythm. I say I'm probably saying that like moments before I get hit. What did I say? Ah! Moments before. Moments before disaster. Get 
Ah, the timing's all wrong. I took a lot of hits, but that was pretty good, I think. Hey, the game agrees. So now I have a boss to fight. Um, I'm gonna get myself some more DT. Would you like to spend microtransactions on this game that's extremely liberal and generous? No. <laughs> Capcom, you should have fucked your game over completely more in order for me to spend money on those. You should have you should have totally ruined the game systems in order to make me spend more. That's how this works, you know? That's I don't know if you guys got the message, but if you guys are overly generous and you know, make your game mechanics well, then I won't buy them. You know, just Maybe Double My Cry 6, you just make everything busted and bad so that I buy more. You know? Just just a thought. <sighs> it's games industry. Alright. That's more of a cutscene for him than I was expecting, actually. Man, those pustules look nice in HDR. After this boss, I may use the restroom, or if I die, uh, depending. Oh. 
Yeah, that's fair. I was kind of like, oh shit, I'm gonna get hit by that. Nah, he can't quite. Oh, he can! Oh, it went away. Shit. I always pop him at the worst moment. Oh no, I, I want to put you away again. Oh! Oh no, I didn't want that. Whoops. Hopefully that does some damage on the side. Eh, it did some, you know. That's some damage. That's fine. It's not quite what I wanted, though. Please allow me to hit you. There you go. Ooh. Yeah, that's an S. I, I feel like that went really well. Uh, we're gonna quickly customize some things, and then I'm going to use my first bathroom break. I say that like I've allotted them. <laughs> I would very much like Helmbreaker to be better and faster, and I would very much like Stinger to be better and faster. So yeah, that works for me. Oh yeah, so give me a quick minute. I'll be back. Just going to the bathroom.
Okay. Give me a quick minute, because I think there may have been a package meant to arrive today that I need to take a double check on. Ah, Friday. Good. Okay. So I don't have to worry about it today. That's good. All right. All right. Mirage Edge. Okay. I don't know why I was calling it the Miracle Edge. It seemed like a weird name on its surface, to be fair. Uh, yeah, Mirage Edge. Makes a lot more sense. Okay. Into mission seven we go. Which again, does not have any orbs. Oh my god, the loading. I was like, yep, I'll just get ready for the load screen. And then I'm like, oh, it's done. <laughs> right. So I made my helm splitter faster and I made my, made my, uh, my stinger better. worked last time, but yeah, I think this would be smarter. Yeah, it would be. Only grounded enemies, huh? Oh, uh, you can actually kind of hit him. that there's no collectibles in this level. You like you would think one. Like that's technically a secret. I just wouldn't count it as a collectible. Oh, he gets spared by the cutscene. Why no bury the light? That's that's probably my biggest issue with this game, is like, I want to listen to the cool soundtrack they made, and there are way too many fights in it where they turn it off for no reason. Like, I'm, I'm not playing Devil May Cry because I want to see your suspenseful atmosphere. That's not why I'm here. I want to bury the fucking light. Nothing else. Oh. 
If the game had, like, an adaptive music on button that just replaced any fight music with the, the actual soundtrack that you want to hear, I feel like this would be a perfect video game. Like, turn the other shit off. I only want to hear what I want. That'd be nice. Run. You know, run? Okay. Okay, buddy. Okay. Fuck. Not the best. Real quick. So there's an option to pause broadcast. Um, I'm not really sure what the, like, I, I, I don't know how that looks. I don't know if I feel comfortable testing that on this stream. I may test it on a later stream. But uh, that might be useful for when I have to eventually eat. Like, as it, like, so I don't have to, like, end the stream. I don't know what that looks like, you know? If that looks like a, it'll be right back or something like that, I don't know what the deal is. Whoa! 
Oh, he's got an extra punch. Oh, that felt good. Hello. Man, that stream overlay is really nice. So much less obnoxious than the PS4 stream overlay. I don't even think it shows up on the stream, so like you can't even see what I'm talking about. Hi, Caitlin. Yeah, no, it doesn't. Yeah, the stream overlay doesn't show up. It's great. Okay, those have to go. Those are a problem. I don't like those. There we go. Escalator, snow. Virgil is your friend. You do. They're very good. Gotta remember to use this shit. It's actually way too good. It's also a nice utility too, because like it's a it's a big clean sweep, but then it pulls them in. Also just looks really cool. Very good utility. It's awesome. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's keep saving for now. I kind of want to get one of these supers. I want to get Judgment Cut End. I want to see it again. So, Cindy T got to be full. Concentration has to be at least level 2. And then... You shall die. It's just super good. My cool. I've written down all Yamato and Mirage as Oh, yeah. Cool. If that helps you internalize, then that's awesome. So, over here... 
we're gonna end up on the sliding platform in a minute. Oh god. It's so ugly pretty. It's a very ugly sight, but it's very pretty. God. I don't think I ever noticed how fucked that is. That was just rude. And that's just mean. Now I'm losing my concentration because of a friggin' plant. Try combo B and upper slash and avoid slash. Avoid slash? Oh, this. Avoid. Got it. Um, let me try that. Let's see. Let me just remind myself. Put those in sequence. So, combo B. Da 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 da. Upper slash. Interesting. Okay, I think I get what you're putting down, so... But, 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 but... Yeah, yeah, I gotcha. But, but... No, I don't actually want to lock on. But, but... You're just gonna make me, huh? There. Now we can do this. Okay. But, but, but... No, 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 no. Bigger delay. But, but... That's not what I wanted, but I was pretty close. So, but, but... Yeah, that's pretty good, actually. That's a nice little combo. I'll have to work that in. I'll give that some practice in the void in a bit. Ah, oh, not fast enough. His little downward jog. And now this is going to inexplicably start sliding because we're going to skip the cutscene. Or, well, it will skip the cutscene. Proto Angelo. Oh! That's not close enough. That's not going to matter. Shit. Mm. I need those shields done. Hi guys, what's up? Yeah, I know. Oh, my God. 
There we go. Yeah? Oh, you're still alive? There we go. Yes, I would very much like Judgment Cut. And... Okay. So let me remind myself where the first... where the orbs are in this level now. Let me take a look at that video. So... Mission 8, at like the big mouth near the customized statue. I don't need to see you going through your customization menu video. I'll, I'll, I'll be fine without knowing what your shit looks like. Uh, and then at the other end of that gap... Oh, wait! But he's using Gerbera to get over there as Nero. Can I even do that with Virgil? Like, can I make that? So far everything else has been doable, but I wonder if that's even possible. And Secret Mission 5 is at the rising elevator thing. That might be a... No, bitch, you gotta come back with Nero, because, you know, that might be that kind of thing. That'd be understandable. So... Okay. So the next one is at the, the rising pillar. That makes sense. Okay. Okay. I have a pretty deep expectation that I'm not going to actually be able to get that one, just if I'm being honest. Um, okay. <sighs> just a quick stretch. All right. My brain is telling me there's something behind him. You mean like a, a red orb thing? No? Okay. That's fine. more than that. Did I get the guide down below by accident too? It's kind of wild. Oh yeah, I meant to go practice that in the void. Oh well. Oh.
Okay, so there's actually a second one here that I need to do this on, because it's not this one. That is a very nice shade of red. I don't even know if it's going to show up properly on the screen because, I mean, I've got HDR running on the, on the console. I don't think that is streamable, but it's a really nice shade. You'll have to trust me. I gotta get concentration to at least level 2 to do judgment cut end. Can, can Virgil get up there? Hey, I see that. Try Yamato combo B to rising starters. Ooh, that's a big one. I'm gonna need to be in the void for, to practice that. Oh, I see. shot. Let me try and put that together in my head. So, combo B, da da da, to rising star. Right. Why do I not remember where that is right now? Did I literally pass it? Yeah, I'm an idiot. <laughs> um... Yeah, okay. So, did a, then follow that into that. Switch to Mirage for combo A. Switch to Mirage. That's a lot. You got some good shit going there. Yeah, I'll try and put that together later. You've very thankfully written it down for me so that that'll work out. the bloodstreams, right? Sometimes there's something behind them. That's gooey! Yeah! Can I even get across there? No. No, I cannot. Yeah, that's 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 Nero shit for sure, unfortunately. Yeah, yeah, that feels pretty fucking good.
Oh. So this is the bit. Well, actually, maybe it's not. Round trip to Rapid Slash to Warp Void slash to Bearwall Special. Huh, okay. Rapid Slash. Let me remind myself. Yeah, of course. That's forward. To Rapid Slash to Warp Void Slash. That makes sense. So, round trip. No, I, I want the sword back, please. Uh, round trip. Silence. To rapid slash. Die. Yeah! Yeah, that's 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 a really good one, actually. That's a really nice one. Because you set them up, toss them in. Need to get a little better on the execution of the last bit, but yeah. Yeah, that's good. Super easy to throw together. Super doable. Let me try and give that a shot. Oh, you. I was a little far away, but still. Fine. Gotta set it up, it's not free. I gotta learn the timing. It takes a lot to set up. Oh! How sloppy! Icky pooey. This, so this is actually the spot in the level that has the has the blue orb, the blorb. Um, unless they put a grim grip there so that you can actually get it as Virgil, I'm going to assume it's just not gonna happen. Although I will actually buy a second Ender. Definitely the Beowulf one. Yeah. 
still gotta get this. And flush, but flush is, you know, it's just, it's just kind of there. It's, it's assistive. It's not super important. Um, yeah, okay. Yeah, so un unless they're, I'll say that at a Grim Grip in the next room, I'm going to assume I cannot get the orb. I'm not seeing anything. I'm gonna say that that's not likely to happen. Unless I can jump here and... No. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! <laughs> wow, I just botched that completely. That's... Oh, Jesus. Gigabots right now. You're not dead. You're nice. You're a big guy. Punched, but it looked like you punched him in the throat. So when I see my next, when I see my next uh, water spout, not water spout, the little, the 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 fucking, um, the little uh, lava rises. I don't know what the fuck you're, I'm trying to say. Then I can get to the secret room, and that should be fine. Let me just check. So the secret room, the, the secret, the secret mission that's coming up, if I'm not mistaken, should be the one that lets you. Um, you have to you have to do all the grapple points without touching the ground, which that should be doable because the grim grip does work like that. Um, okay. One of them is as simple as just hitting the thing, hitting something behind one of the blood streams before it opens up, and then it'll allow me in. There's the there's the lava. Upper fall. I don't know what the fuck to call that. Ah. Oh.
you know what? You get it. Yeah. Total waste, but, like, felt cool. Wanted to see it. You get DT pretty liberally, so I'm actually not feeling too bad about it. Ah! So I want to go over there. Yeah, not, not far enough. that I can drop. There. And down here. Get to the goal without touching the ground. Should be simple enough. Okay. This actually kind of feels easier because you're not subjected to the, the, I don't want to say inconsistency, but the chance that the grip might fuck up. Okay, wait, never mind. <laughs> okay, the speed of this is going to be interesting. This, the, the speed, yeah, because this is a lot faster than you would do it when you were doing Nira. It shoots you out faster, too. Ooh. Yeah, there you go. I, I, that was actually easier than when I did it as Nero, yeah, because it, it just goes faster. Also, sometimes you're, if, let's say, you hadn't upgraded your Snatch as far as you could have, then you have a problem. <laughs> Oh, good, they put that there so you could just get straight to the straight to progression. That's awesome. Okay, I'm pretty sure the the blorb is behind this. So if I go around. Yep. Is that enough? Is that four? No, it's not. So the next one is in mission nine. So let's keep going. Great. Oh yeah, that piano. Oh my god, look at him. It's haunting. Got all the diseases now. Been a while. Let me check my sound. Everything's good. 
Everything's good. Okay. Where's, where's my charge at? Oh, my charge is at two. I can afford to plug it in now, actually. There we go. Got a nice uh, nine foot cable from Amazon. It's excellent. I don't have to worry about pulling this thing off its stand. What's my next goal? My next goal is probably going to be Deep Stinger, honestly. Just because I want all three of those so that my brain doesn't have to compromise on the input in any situation. If I can get to that upper area without Gerbera. I don't remember the platform being this low. Huh. No, no, this is the part where you needed Gerbera. Can I even do that with Virgil? Kinda looks like I can't. It's an optional area, but still. Might need that for what's about to happen. Alright, yours in part two. I actually don't even remember if I'm supposed to win this one. Ow. I jumped into it! I jumped straight into it! Ah. Okay, I gotta get back on that up when I see the glow. Canonically, this makes no sense! Oh god! Ah! Given the amount of damage I'm actually doing, I'm going to say this is still a losable, a losing fight. Ah. Or no, you have to break the crystal in this one, that's it. Oh wait, yeah, holy shit, the damage is not even comparable. Wow! Fabio wasn't kidding. The the spinning thing is is like a decent finisher, but it ain't that. Oh, I'm gonna die for sure. Look at my health. Unless.
Oh, I don't have enough. I don't have enough concentration. Uh, and here I am trying to do this thing. That's fine. I was kind of doing that with the seat of my pants because I was like, I'm not gonna make it. How fast can you get behind the enemies? To do some I don't think. I think. You, I think overdrive is one of the ones. I have drive, but I haven't actually gotten overdrive on uh, Virgil yet. It's one of the ones I haven't hit yet. Oh yeah, that is a losing fight. Never mind. I did perfect in that case. <laughs> I knocked it out of the park. But yeah, uh, overdrive is one of the ones. Well, you know, we can we can hit try and find out how fast can you get behind the enemy to use another combo save. Drive to 13 kicks? Perhaps. Go to hell. That's the wrong input. Go to hell. If I delay it ever so slightly, I might Go be able to, to get all the kicks on him. Mm. Spacing needs Go to be to a hell. little tighter. Felt like it didn't it breached more kicks the first time. Go to hell. Oh. Yeah, that actually caught more. Yeah, well, that's pretty. That's pretty decent. Uh, but yeah, the first one was after doing overdrive. How fast can you get behind him? You can like almost see. Let me remind myself. C is, of course. Yeah, it's the full one. Okay. So, let's see. Go to hell. It's over. I need to think about that in a different way. Need to make that make sense in my brain. Okay, so let's try. Go to hell. It's over. Fast enough. Fast enough. Yeah, that works. I'll give it another shot. Go to hell. That no. Go Do the hell. thing. It's over. That's that. As a dash. Yeah. So, let's try that. Go to hell. It's over. Down you go. You're finished. Don't go. Cool. Uh, but of course, I'm not getting overdrive just yet because I want the crazy Psycho Crusher. Yeah. So mission nine. So the first purple orb is located behind a... God, that loading. Is located behind one of the spots that used to be accessible. Yeah. Uh, it used to be accessible via popping the big guy. Oh, thank God, Barry, the light's back. <laughs> I just wish I could turn off the non-hype music at all times. I just want a button I can press in the options menu that turns that shit off forever. I only want the good shit. Only the best music. Why is that so much to ask, Atsuno?
why would I ever want Bury the Light to not be on? Whenever Bury the Light is not playing, everyone should be asking, why is Bury the Light not playing? Or Devil Trigger. Hitboxes change on level of concentration. My hitbox or theirs? That's important. That was awful. Just miss, just whips, whip central. There goes. Virgils. That's awesome. Well, actually, does it make him easier or harder to hit is also important. <laughs> if he's easier to hit at higher concentration would be funny. about making that one I don't know if that I don't know if you could do that without V's like flight thing That's a, nah, I fucked that up. Yeah, I felt that immediately. Oh, I thought I dodged that. Jump, I guess. Just lost completely.
Oh, wow, they actually killed me. You know what? That fight was going so badly that I want to redo it, to be honest. Yeah. So you could mod in the every time you die it says easy mode is now selectable. Good, it actually put me at the start. I'm actually not upset about that. I'd rather that. The fade out on that is so nice. That was awesome. That did a lot less than I thought it was gonna. <laughs> Armor, I guess. At least I don't have to worry about um, the wrong music playing in Bloody Palace. So, you know. Consolation, I guess. Could have sworn there was an enemy group here. Oh, yeah, there we go.
That has armor! Again, might seem like a waste, but it makes me happy. And that's all that matters. But that's good to know that that has armor. So like, that one, that one is coming out, doesn't matter. Makes sense, because Beowulf. Flyers have to go first. And you. You're just an asshole. Ah! Much better than last time. like a samurai cross. That was incredible. Oh. Now's, a, now's an important question, which is, is this thing that would normally open when V did... Yes, it's open! Good. They get... Yeah, they understand. It has to just be open for that to make sense. Okay, so what's the next one after this one? Also, that might be... No, that wasn't another. Show me your I have not been using his taunts at all, but that's fine. Um... I'm not that ballsy. Um, so the next secret mission... It's actually very close. Oh yeah, it's, it's, it's literally on the steps above. I'm, oh, it's, it's on screen! <laughs> what is this one? All demons in 20 seconds or less. Okay. Sure. Whew. Let's see how that goes. Yeah, that's... I gotta go way faster than that. Thank you, Beowulf. Pretty sure that's health. Yes, it is. 
Excellent. So the next one is a purple orb. It's in the crypt area. Normally you would have to get, you'd have to bring Nightmare out to open the room, but I imagine it's already open on Virgil's. So I'll just be able to walk in. Okay. Cool. I imagine the room will be much harder to miss because of that. So in the crypt, which is where I'm heading down to now. Orbs are important. Give them to me. Definitely going to get overdrive on the next thing, I think. I think that would make the most sense. Unless something else catches my eye. That being said... Whoa! <laughs> that, that being said, I'm not using drive as much as I really should. And I really should. That air stinger is actually super good and I should use it more often. I tried. I tried. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> there may come a point in the stream where I eat, which may literally be me kind of crunching. I mean, like, I'll talk. I mean, as much as it would, as, that I, as it wouldn't be rude because I would try to chew, uh, try to talk between bits. But yeah, there may be like a solid 10 minutes where I'm just kind of chilling. That wasn't everybody. That was everybody, okay. Just, just three of those guys. That's not everyone. Hello? Uh... Uh... Um... Oh! That's so weird!
All right, cool. Where was the next one? Actually, isn't there one like in the hallway? My brain is telling me there's one like in the hallway. Let me check the video. There is in fact, okay. That feels like it might be a tricky jump for Virgil, but we'll try. Nah, that's fine. I don't know why I thought that would be tricky. So the one after this... Next mission. It's in the Dante mission. Okay. Yeah, it's in one of those, like, timed, closey, holy things. I clearly have a very well-thought-out name for them. Okay. Well, we'll keep on the lookout for that in the meantime. dramatic die for a single red orb thing. Ah. I kind of thought that would stop him. I love this blue boy. I love him so much. So much versatility, even more than four. It's kind of the name of DMC5 though, like, let's just take everything that exists and make it bigger. I, I'm i probably still gonna only find fault with V's moveset in the sense that, I, like, every character, like, Dante when gets like a huge expansion of his moveset from Sin DT. And also, his moveset is just ridiculously large anyways. It's like five characters. Nero gets a huge expansion with his DT. And V just never really has that big expansion moment. Whereas, I think Virgil's had a big expansion moment, but you kind of just get it right off the bat because, you know, progression. Um, kind of makes me wish V got some extra shit. I thought from the trailer that the implication they were going for is that they were going to do that by making it so that you could change between V and Virgil at any point. I thought that's what they were trying to imply with the trailer. Uh, sometimes that's not what they were trying to imply, but you know. Instead you just do this. And this is cool, but I thought you were going to switch characters. Come hittable. Oh, 
thought I could parry that. Ah! But yeah, like this is a this is a wonderful expansion of his move set, and it feels all very natural. <laughs> the most useless round trip ever. Hey, did you fucking blocking blocking the, block the way? Just ooh. I really need to use this more often. This is very useful, and I'm not using it. Overdrive is very useful, so let's go for that. Just makes the thing I'm already doing pretty helpful. Go to hell. It's over. How much more effective is the level one charge versus the level two? Let's let's try and see if we can spot the difference there. Go to hell. So level one. It's over. Go to hell. Charge it up. It's over. The question will be if it hits that. No. I uh, I can't really tell then. Does it is it going farther? Go to hell. Maybe it just does more damage. Go to hell. Silence. Go to hell. Oh my god. Go to hell. It's over. Okay, well, either way, it's good. Oh fuck, these dudes are coming up. I hate them. Fucking hate these things. Oh my god, stop! I got him, but I just don't like fighting those. But, oh yeah, right, the mission ends there. There's like no logical through line for Virgil, because like, he's literally just, because like, the campaign's three different separate characters who are often in three different places, literally just teleporting around. Now, like, now he's in a flashback, like. Uh Dragon Breaker would be nice. Flush. Ah, 
complete the moveset? Yeah. Yeah, sure. You know, a little, little extra never hurt. Um, so, Dragon Breaker. That's a good thing to keep in mind. Uh, Yamato's done. Miracle Edge is also done. I keep calling it Miracle Edge. I don't know why I keep... I think someone in a video called it Miracle Edge. Now it's stuck in my head. Uh, Mirage Edge is done. So all that's really left is I need to power up Mirage Blades again. And the block, which I don't have, and I don't even know how much I'd use. Um, let me see the parry. That's good. Thank you for being there, if not far away. It seems like it's just kind of a block, not like a parry parry, which is fine. But yeah, we've almost got all of Virgil. We need, just need to power up those blades. The block would be nice. Enemy step, I guess. You know, that wouldn't hurt. Certainly wouldn't hurt. And then uh, I think we'll probably pop the rest into upgrades on the other things. And then I guess I'll just save all my points to upgrade the other characters. I love that piano. I should just be using the standard swords more, to be honest. They're useful. They let you pepper in enemies and get some concentration. Go over him? No, it didn't. Man, the, the, the level of care that they did in adding Virgil's moveset, like, makes me just a little sad we didn't get Trish and Lady back, because I would have loved to see what else they could do with them. So good. Hey, I mean, I actually don't think I have enough to buy anything yet, but no, yeah, not at all. <laughs> I thought, thought I could be smart. Oh, 
Ah! I'm trying to block that with high roller. I usually don't end it on that hit, you usually follow it up with the rest, but there's like a cool animation on that. Yeah. Usually you end up doing the whole thing, but like, that's actually a really cool finish too. Yes, I need to do these these fights fast or else I lose these. I have no idea if they added new moves for V. I'm going to assume they didn't. Well, if you count that as a new move for V, then yes, technically. here before that closes. Okay, time to do this fight as fast as I can. Now Whew. 
Okay, let's run our asses up there before that shit closes. Don't fucking fall here. Okay. <laughs> okay, let me check. Let me check the video for the next one. Okay, so after this one, fragment number 20. No, it's purple orb number four is... Oh, I think it might actually be in the same room. Yeah, hold on. Let me see. Where is it? Out the exit. Oh. I see. Okay. Cool. So now down. In here. I think that might actually be another DT piece. Yep. Awesome. Uh, so then, where is the next one? Let's see. The next one is... Secret mission number seven. Which is in... Sorry, I need to full screen this so I understand the zone I'm looking at. Oh, it's the area with the big bug. Okay. And then he's got that. Da, da, da. And then when you go through there, run up the pathway. Climb the thing. Secret mission is in there. Okay. That should be fine. All right. That damage is actually ridiculous. That's a fucking combo. It's, are we not done? No, we're not.
Yeah, that's fair. Without the context of the cutscenes, honestly, it's really funny because you're just rolling through losing fight after losing fight after losing fight with Yurizen until you're eventually tough enough to fight him. Okay, wait, there are actually two of those doors in here, so let me be 100% clear I know which one is which. I think this might be a thing where I have to play the level more than once. This might be. There's a possibility. Let's check. So, the door is specifically the one on the left. No way he goes up the one on the right. Um, so then he does that side mission. And then that's it. The next one is in mission 11. I don't think that hit him. No, it didn't. There we go. Okay, I need to go into the one on the on the other side. I have no idea what's in the left one then. I gotta mute Discord. <laughs> Aim for the weak point and take them down with a single bullet. I don't have bullets, but fine. Okay, so as I remember, my brain was like, okay, you have to get rid of their scissors enough to where they'll, they'll open their weak point. But no, I actually just have to wait. exact moment is it during the is it during the spiral it's been a while forty minute break uh this guy gotta remember the timing on the on the one hit ko I think it's during the spiral but I'm not sure the the exact moment No. When is it? I do have a video here that thankfully shows himself doing all of them, so maybe he can, maybe he can enlighten me as to the moment I'm looking for. Oh, he actually does attack. Oh, I am supposed to attack. Fuck, I have to I have to make sure I don't do any hits that do real damage.
fuck! <laughs> he's, he's weak when he's just appearing. Yeah, it is. Just, yeah, just a parry would be fine. Done. It's been a long time since I did that guy. Usually I break their guard by just doing it. So what's the one on the other side? Is it closed? No, I still have a chance. Awesome. It's just a, it's just a gold. Nothing super important. No. One second. I gotta get my headset set up. But because technically the headset, uh, the con the controller mic might have kicked in for a second. I don't use them anyway. Should you shoot ghosts? I think your stream might be a bit behind. Oh, I rolled into it. That time I didn't roll at all, which is still not preferable. Yeah. I have been using it to evade a lot. My problem was that I was using it exclusively, and I wasn't using jump at all, and it became pretty clear I was supposed to be using both. I thought it took that jump actively took away from, uh, from concentration, but it turns out that's only if you jump needlessly. If, it, if the jump is a dodge, it, it doesn't count.
Well, shit, yeah. Virgil is basically done. Basically. Not really done, but basically done. All right, time to lose again. I'm gonna break your shield and cannon! <laughs> Running up on myself like that. That's fine. I am going to set food up for the next half hour. Uh, I will be right back. Okay. Let me. One of these. One of these was actually important. Like I know. I know judgment cup. But I want to read that. It adds the most attacks by holding it in position. Triangle. When the scabbard flashes, I need to actually pay attention to that more. Yeah. One second. Let me just set the room up for when I do eat, so that I can make a, I can make a smooth transition from pausing to eating to back to playing. All right. I am actually going to practice for a bit, because I would like to get some judgment cut timing into my brain. So. <laughs> 
No. Because there's a specific spot where you can use Judgment Cut, or it doesn't require like a big charge up. In the air, it seems fine. Like, like where you can do it with that kind of timing. Frame perfect. So... Hmm. Frame perfect release, not a hold. Okay, when you say release, that ignore that ignores a hold. Well, I know. Well, I mean, I have to hold to set it up, but then I have to release it again. You will know when there is no star up on the slash. Yeah. Like that. Yeah, that's the one. Of course, it's it's different on every move, so... The timing is, of course, strict. That's that. Yeah. That's actually a pretty easy one. That one. That that's actually pretty easy to follow up. Yeah, that one. I see the time. Oh, you could just do them all. Great. Oh, can't! <laughs> okay, that, that makes more sense. timing on that one. That's one I'd like to know. Uh, 
I feel like it's gotta be in the slash somewhere. Yeah, I feel like it, it can't be as they're being knocked back. It has to be somewhere earlier. Back, triangle, triangle, dimension slash. As in, like, uppercut? Can you give me move names? Are you sure that works in this one or or four? Good jump cancel the slash. Uh, back triangle. Hold back triangle. So. I can get that mostly consistent. It's somewhere... Yeah, it's like, okay, so, so the timing is like, it's at the apex of when he's got the, sword, the katana up. And, and now, just to prove the world's point, I can't do it. Okay, maybe that timing was just all wrong. I think I learned something that completely fucked me. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it is later. I want to say that it's at the moment that he hits the ground, but I feel like if I learn that, that will fuck me over on different enemies that have different animations. So I don't want to. I don't want to internalize that. Don't go. Wait, maybe I should be looking at the enemies instead. It's at the moment he hits the apex. Yeah, it's at the moment he hits the top of the of the juggle. It's not anything I'm doing, it's when he hits the top. Yeah. 
Consistent. I got a trophy for that. Yeah. There you go. Oh my god, it actually is when they hit the ground. Maybe I should be thinking of it that way. Oh my god, wait a minute, do I have it? I, oh my god, it, it's actually more about watching them than it is about watching Virgil. It is, it's way more about watching them. Huh. Oh my god. Dude. Okay, wait, I think we have something here. I'm curious how well that'll hold up on other enemies, because, like, hitboxes being what they are and animations. Unless it's actually keyed differently to every enemy, that could be possible. In which case, it, it would be more about still watching the enemy than it is about watching Virgil. Sorry if you hear rustling, I'm putting something warm over me. Okay, what what other moves can I Second link. Okay. Okay, I'm kind of starting to get the timing. I, I would never have thought it would be more about watching them than it would be about watching Virgil. Wow, okay. What what other moves in the Yamato moveset can I try and learn that I'll learn on that? Or I kinda got everything. Get the aerial cleave. Aerial cleave, why am I not Oh yeah, no, it's that thing. Check thing. Check thing what? Check... Th so you have visual context. Okay. Do you mean switch to other enemies so that I can try and map it? Although that's not a bad idea, admittedly. Like, what does it look like on you, for example? Not as easy to do on you because you're <laughs> fucking. Oh, you're not coming with me. Oh, 
Actually, wait, that's not a bad one to try and figure out. Yeah, no, you have a different, you have a different, like, box that makes you fly. I'm starting to understand because now, now I'm kind of doing it on an enemy that doesn't require the 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 flingbacks, you know. Sorta. Of. I'm not perfect, but like I'm kind of doing it. Yeah, I can't depend on him flying back at a certain distance. That being said, the timing is becoming more clearer. It's not, I can't get it quite consistent, but I'm doing it. Okay. Okay. I'm starting to understand. Let's say if I was to switch it to someone like... Where's, where's Rolly Derby? Where's Roller? Is it you? Are you, are you Rolly Derby? Yes, you are. I'm still not 100% sure what you meant by check thing for visual context, but yeah. But I'm starting to feel it's not visual that I'm looking for for these ones, it's, it is actually timing. Link above? Have you been putting links in my chat? Because if they have, then I'm not seeing them. Maybe that maybe that's just a thing you can't do, because yeah. Cause I haven't seen any links. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Oh. Okay, Fabio has sent me a link in real time. Let me take a look at this. This is DMC4 stuff, but I'm going to assume and hope that it does in fact carry over, but I'll take a look. Let me mute this real quick. Let me full screen. Hmm. I feel like this has confused me more. <laughs> oh, okay. Now let's learn about the combo. Okay. Hmm. Okay. This is a lot. <laughs> Okay. Oh, yeah, wow. I don't know if that'll work, but shit. That's, that's some crazy shit right there. Okay. All right, I'm going to minimize this for now. Okay. Don't know if I'll be able to pull that off, but that's interesting. I'm I'm uh, I'm understanding how to feel out the timing. It looks like on certain enemies I can actually rely on the air bounce to tell me when. But, the fact that I'm starting to understand the timing without it is good. Okay, um, I think I've got a decent handle on it. Of course, now I will go into actual levels and you will see me quickly botch everything that I just think I learned. Uh, but, uh, yeah. You know. I think I, I understand the process now, which is more than I did before. Let me... Fast forward this video and understand where the first collectible is. The first collectible in the next mission is for secret mission number eight. And it is for... It's in the little palace area. You break the pustule. That thing falls. And then you go back up. Then he can go upstairs. Okay, that makes sense. Let's see if I can put some judgment cuts in my basic combos. Let's see. Already failing. Wait. Again, I need to watch the enemy. Okay. 
I can actually put them in. I'm going... Uh, I'm just going to go out on a limb here. Just going to go out on a limb and say... The timing might be more lax than DMC4. Just, just gonna, just gonna go on a limb and say that. Just, just say that I may, in fact, be a baby bitch who could never play this for real, as the kids would say, uh, in DMC4, where it is apparently real and not here, as I'm sure some Devil May Cry people would tell me. But you know. They may have lacked the timing. They lacked the timing for Royal Guard, so I wouldn't. I wouldn't be so shocked. It's the moment that it's the moment their air bounce. It's the it's the apex. Holy shit! I'm sure there's a couple moves I won't be able to consistently do it on, but like I've got enough to where I can be happy. Uh, straw people are everywhere. You can't escape them. Man, that's it's man, that's not a distorted real impact, but it's good. It's good. Like that damage is ridiculous. In a few minutes I'm gonna grab food. Just to be clear. I made sure that it's the food I can eat quick so that I can get back into it. Now we're going up here. Which, what is this one? Sure! Let's see! Yeah, oh my god.
Okay. Um, I'm going to quickly grab the food, and then I will be here. And, uh, yeah. Give me one minute. And I was eating some of it on the way back, so I'm almost done anyway. <laughs> Just pray that I don't eat so fast I choke and die on stream. That would be hilarious. In quotes. Hilarious in quotes. I kind of can't believe I figured out the release on those release, uh, the the inputs, the timing on that release. I was not expecting that was that was in me. But again, I'm sure it's easier than it used to be. Social eating. Almost done. I'm gonna cram this last one in my mouth. Done. Alright, give me a minute to pack this shit up, clean up, and then we'll be back on it. Probably until it's done, to be honest, from there. Right back in a minute. Okay. Whew. Never paid attention to that little 
teleport animation when they get back. It's kind of neat. Okay. So after that one, what was the next one? So let's see. The next orb after the maintain stylish was dropping down. Dante kills the pustule. Oh, that's super easy. Right below us. In fact, it's so easy. Show me where the one after it is. Does it matter if I pick up the Kalina Ann as, as Virgil? Is it there? Because <laughs> they're showing that in the video, because it's an all collectibles thing. Yeah, let me fix my bed just a little bit, get it more comfy. So that we may continue burying said light. Oh, hello. Hell yeah! What's the charge on this controller? That's not what, something I like to see. Where I pull up the thing and it says, Mystery. Virgil, Virgil, calm down. I looked at the fucking battery icon and it was like a, it was like a question mark. I don't think that's good. But either way, it says it's fully charged, so I'll unplug it now. Ah, fuck, not you guys. You know what? Oh my god, you can chain them? You can chain the level 3s? Oh my god! You have enough time to do a second one? Holy shit! You have enough time to do two screen clears! That's ridiculous! Uh, okay, but yeah, so that was where the Kalina Ann was. I know where the Kalina Ann is. And you go up there. Sure. I doubt it's going to actually make a difference if I go for the Kalina Ann now. But the next purple fragment is in the little zone. Okay, yeah, I recognize this place. Um, so you go in there. Oh, and then you're going to climb up there. And you're going to go up that way. Oh, oh. Oh, clever, clever. Okay. Got it. <laughs> Clean the first level. It's it's funny. I, well, actually, you can't hear me anymore because you just said you went on mute. But um, I get the PSN notifications of your message and get to read a little bit of it way before it shows up on YouTube. Way before. Yeah, of course the clean ants not here, but yeah.
Uh, okay. Yeah, and then this lowered that. Holy shit. Oh, these guys. Oh my god, the guy on the side hit me. Oh! That's bad. Oh, that hit me on the backswing. Oh, what?
That's funny. I totally saw Five Hours last comment on on PSN, like on the actual stream on my TV screen, but it has not shown up in the in the chat. So like, <laughs> that's kind of weird. It, YouTube ate that one, but PSN was like, no, you get to see what he says. So we've got that one now. Purple orb number six is on the little pedestal you got on the left path in the next mission. And you run all the way down there. You're going all the way up the little slope. And then you take a left and you go into this room and you get a you get a probe, a purple orb. Okay. I wonder if I can see the comments now. Oh my god. Bruh, can I just can I can I have a minute to myself? I would not mind some upgrades, even though I'm pretty cleaned out for Virgil's moveset at this point. Um, I mean, sure, I mean, it seems like a good thing to have. I, I imagine it's better than taking a hit, you know? That's, that's the ultimate philosophy, is like, hey, you're going to spend some concentration, but would you rather take a hit? I think that's ultimately the idea. There's gonna come a point where I'm just gonna be spending points and getting the last of the um, the purple and blue orbs from the shop. I'm sure. Oh yeah, I can go forward. Oh shit, this is the end. Hey, what's up, Cavalier? Let's go. Trish, motorcycle lady, let's let's do it together. Oh my god, I'm getting rocked. Gotta get better at these dodges.
I am learning Virgil. Oh! I think Virgil didn't- I think Virgil just clicked. I think something just happened in my brain. I feel incredible right now. Like, like, I- yeah, I took a lot of hits, but like, I was- I was feeling the rhythm. Build the concentration. Be cool. Don't go in. Get- get what you want. Holy shit, dude. Uh, how I many enemies? Honestly, let's prioritize what matters. Let's get the rest of those, and then we'll worry about our stuff. I'm not super worried that I'm just gonna be just fucked without Virgil's enemy step. Wait, he's dead? Really? Oh, okay. Oh! Oh. That trick for learning them on seeing, like, the moment the enemy hits the apex of their air bounce is, like, perfect. Because, like, it gives you a sense of, even if you're, even if it, you can't reliably watch that all the time, it, 
lets you learn the timing, which is good, you know? Okay, well, it looks like the left path that I saw earlier that I was like, yo, it's good that I can just go that way. Um, well, it's clearly blocked by a Nidhogg thing. So I guess I'm going to go that way. Ah, there we go. And now and uh, and now I have one of these and I know exactly where to use it. Here. I think there's an encounter right here. Yep. That felt good. Okay, and then this. Yeah. Stop. I'm gonna get hit by the fucking cynical. I didn't. I didn't get hit by it. Hey, I missed one. The air stinger is super satisfying. It's different. Now I'm second guessing myself on if Dante has an air stinger. I don't think he does. that way, but what I actually want is this way. Just covered in that. Covered. Whoa. I still want to actually go in because there is something in here for me. Wait, no, I passed. I passed something. Let me look at the video again. What? Are, where is it? Yeah, it's in there. 
He goes into that room. That's where I just went. Oh my god, I'm blind. I'm blind. I'm blind. I'm blind. I'm blind. Cool. Where is the next one? Let's see. The next one is... Let's see. Let's open this up. So, still in the same mission in this area. Hmm. Behind another of the pustules. Well, if this area isn't optional, then... Yeah, okay, cool. I can remember that. All right. Let's keep moving. Whoa! Could you let me out, please? I feel like I've skipped an area. But let's keep going. Oh no, I'm back here now, okay. I thought that was a, I guess that was a dead end. And now we introduce a new enemy. This motherfucker. Oh my god, I didn't get touched! I hate that guy, but I rocked him! Oh my god. Very upset with you. That hit me again. I'm very unhappy with you, sir. That guy might be my kryptonite. 
Virgil based kryptonite. This might be the pustule that I'm left for. Strong. That's instant for those, damn. One thing though, I feel like I missed something when I walked in. Oh, yeah, I totally did. Cool, and now the next one is... Huh. This one might be tricky. It says I need to equip Trickster, which is Dante. I mean, I might be able to make this work, but let me see what... It's, it's obviously a platforming challenge. Let's, let me see what the deal is. Hmm. I can see the issue. That could be tricky. But we'll see what we can do about it. I'll give it a good try, I just don't know if that's actually possible with Virgil. Actually don't know where to go. Cool. Too slow. So
Yes. Check that. <laughs> He's always so fucking pissed off to touch it. Uh, I bet Dante doesn't have to do this. He does. Then what the hell is this for? This is just another pathway? Does it, does it lead to the same juncture? That takes just a little too long. That feels like loading that they just didn't bother to take out of this version. I see. Alright, we'll give it our best shot, but I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to make this. So the trick, so the deal is I need to get from here to there. Motherfucker, I did I did it! I actually didn't think I'd be able to make it, but I totally made it. Stay in the air for more than 15 seconds. Huh! With Virgil, that might actually be pretty easy. Because I could just keep... I could just keep, like, dodge warping, you know? Okay, well, he fell to the ground, which wasn't very helpful of him. But yeah, this is actually way more doable than Dante's was. Let's go to you first. Fuck! Okay, I think I need to, like, let them just kind of get a little bit of distance from each other, you know? I need them to just sort of... Enter in a live state. Yeah. No! Okay, I need I need to remember to also change targets. I need to remember to press that button. Wait, I can literally just do this. Uh, fuck you, I win. Yeah, like, that's that's like saying, hey, Nero, stay in the air. Okay, I'll just keep snatching. Actually, no, that wouldn't work for Nero because his things pull things to him as opposed to the other way around. Which is, which is Virgil. Yeah, no, that's ridiculously easy as Virgil. Uh, so then the next one... Oh my god, the fucking barrel faded in and I thought it was like a visual effect. Uh, so then the next one is at the end... Oh no, wait, that's that's just... Okay, yeah. Uh, that's, that's in mission 14. Okay. Okay, so the next one is in mission 14. So we're good for a bit. Why, yes, I would love to. I would, I would rather DT just be done than, than health at this point, honestly. Yeah, I'll, I mean, I'll also get these, but, like, I'm not super worried about them anymore, you know? Hmm. 
look, Virgil, it's your home where your mother didn't abandon you and you've lived under a lie for your whole life. Oh, we're done? Okay. Oh, yeah, wait, no, don't we just... Yeah, no! <laughs> oh. I'll face myself! What am I doing? That does that does like crazy damage. Fuck. I'm gonna have to learn you later, that's for sure. But I'm not learning you right now. Yeah, I'm clearly failing at that. Fuck, I really thought that I could dodge that, and then I didn't. Oh my god, it tracks all the way! But good to know that I could just fucking Beowulf through that shield phase. Get tricky. Yeah, trick down, trick up, fast, trick down, rapid landings, great for evading, trick dodge. One second. Wait. I'm getting a very important news, very live. Oh. Just. It's a very good day. Ah. Oh. It's, a, it's, a, it's an alright day. It's a pretty, it's a pretty good day. Good. Okay. Persona 5 Scramble got a, well, tentative release. So, yeah. That's pretty good for me. Alright, let's try this again. dodge those effectively. Ah! Oh God! with that shield again.
Yeah, that's fair. Okay, here isn't. I mean, I'm gonna fight you again, but still. That's a fight. Yeah, I know, I know. Pretty sure that's enough for the last blue orb as well. Cool. So, let me just be absolutely sure. That there are no collectibles in Mission 14. Or Mission 13. Yeah, there are none. So, this one, this next one will be uh, collectible free. If I'm not mistaken, this is the, like, this is the level where you can pick, originally you can pick any of the three characters, and you can, like, you basically, you're just rolling down. Uh, Wall doppelganger is active first of all, with the right time on your devil clone will execute a judgment cut. These judgment cuts will hit harder, faster, and you're going to be weaved in almost any action. Well, hell yeah, that sounds good to me. Yes, this is in fact the mission where we're just going to head down. Gotta get rid of you guys. Oh god, there's one of you again. Fuck that armor up! Get out of the way! I just want you gone. And he's gone. Why is it not coming out? That's really weird. Do I have to wait even longer? The fuck? Why is it not coming out? I'm really confused by this. Oh yeah, I need to wait way longer. Cool. 
Okay. That wasn't all of the levels. Uh, where am I going? Ah. Shit, I was almost there too. I would really appreciate it if you would not do that. I got these. Oh wow, I had a frame rate shutter for the first time. I think that might be the first time on the console, actually. Cool. I got a little rocked at the end there, but...
I did get them all. Okay, good. Which means I spend the rest on enemy step, something I'll probably never use. Then get more orbs, and I mean, I doubt I'm going to get that by the end, but like, you know. If you don't have time to world of the right. What's up with these? I think that's there because they they expect V to be able to glide over those quickly. Oh! And we're just here. Okay, and now I need to get up here. Okay, and... Well, if I could just do that, then surely I can just... Ah! Find the right spot. Hmm... Oh, yeah, what the trick? You can try and make it up, actually. Yeah, yeah, okay. Gotcha. Oh, you know what I just realized? You can probably trick up. You can probably wall jump and then trick up to get to that one in the Nero level that I was like, I guess we can't do that one. Yeah, I didn't even think about that. That's that's probably how you do that with Virgil. Huh. Cool. Okay, well next up, what's the next one? Let's see. Purple Orb Fragment appears to be after the boss rush. And then there's a drop. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, either way, it's after the boss rush. I'll take another look at that later. Let's try and get a sense of it. Alright. Let's go in. These are going to be very different fights. Oh, no, wait. They wouldn't be because I've already fought all three of these as Virgil. Never mind. Okay. Oh, but they give you health health pickups now. Okay. Because Virgil can't otherwise. Wait. Okay. Cavalier again. Good. You were fun last time. Neuragia, Angelo. Yeah. 
Yeah, I've got it. Ha <laughs> Oh! Holy shit, dude. I can't believe I got that. Just a, like a like a full screen projectile is what it effectively becomes when you've mastered that. All right, Goliath. Here we go. early. Yeah, fuck you too. V's last level. They're like, this level's long if you don't have the crazy shit. Just fuck it. You can slide along. They're like, this would be really annoying if you had to walk it as Virgil, so fuck you. Here. That's shockingly pragmatic. Okay, so I want to break the pustule. And then I think I want to jump down there? No, not there. Can't. I think it's here. Yes, it is. Okay. Um... And then, 
after that one, there's another secret mission in the area where I can break the pustules. Okay, I see. And can I get back up out of here? Yeah, okay. There should be a pustule somewhere. I like that word, okay? I, I like saying it. Pustule. Okay, there's one. Okay, hold on. There's that area that Nero has to do that where you could where you have to skateboard with the with with punchline. How are they gonna do that with Virgil? How how what what are they gonna are, gonna, are they gonna throw up the the grim hooks again? Is that is that what they're gonna do? Because like that might they might have to. to the goal without touching the ground. Okay, it seems to be implying dive kick. Don't know if that's accurate. Was it without touching the ground? Was that was that the deal? Do not touch the ground. How the fuck? Cuz like I I understand with V how you're not supposed to touch the ground. Okay, well, they showed Beowulf's dive kick. They're showing Beowulf's dive kick, which means maybe you actually need to, like, set it up. Okay, wait. No, I understand what you have to do. That's crazy. Wow. If that's what they're asking, that's nuts. Okay, yeah, look at the arc on it. I don't even know if that's the actual arc it usually has, but, like, shit. Okay. Okay. This is doable, but boy is it precise. Thankfully they tell you exactly what they want from you. Okay, yeah, I need to get that right at the edge. Okay. This is fucked. <laughs> but I kind of like how, how busted it is. Oh, I was completely wrong. Hmm. Okay. Okay, that's the way. It, it's trick up. I, there was a split second where I didn't press the button, so I've got to get that exact. This is this is nuts. I like this. Yeah, that's fun. I like that. Okay. So, what's the next one? Yeah, the next one is secret mission number 15. Sorry, 11 at the first divinity statue in mission 15. Hmm. And you go behind it. And you get to the skateboard zone. I don't know how they expect you to do that with Virgil, but whatever. We'll see. We'll figure it out. We'll see what happens when we get there. How about that? Okay. For now, we ride.
it is wild going through all these without the cutscenes. It's 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 actually really funny. How much do I need for that? Yeah. Don't really think he needs it anymore, but you know. At this point, I'm basically collecting orbs for the other characters. And that's okay. Oh, this shit. Uh, yeah, the upper path and the lower path. Fuck! I'm still good. Fuck! Apparently there's enemies around here. Hello! Second, I did not mean to exit the game. Uh, one second. The trick sword killed him. That's very satisfying when it happens, because it's like a little poke.
cool. So, this is the zone with the with the with the course. So, what's in it? How do how can this possibly be done? Okay, I'm. Oh, I see grim grips. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Got it. Yeah, I totally understand how that one can be gotten without uh, Nero now. Uh, to go there. Hmm. And how would one do this? Probably with momentum on this one, if I had to guess. Oh, you can just get up there. Or was that a mistake? Was that not supposed to happen? Oh. Well, it's hucking me past a lot of them, uh, a lot of the orb crates, but, you know, it's fine. I get it. <laughs> Time to crate, always in effect. straight for the goal! It's a Sonic level. Ah, uh, I see. This could, could be a pain in my ass. This could very well be a pain in my ass. Fuck. Nope, not on this run. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. Fuck. Fuck yeah. Some bullshit on that. I love it. And the next one.
The next one after that, I have to skim through the video where he actually does it. Right after exiting the secret mission. Really? That sounds promising. Okay. I see. Okay. So I'm going to have to do some bullshit to make this work is what I'm... It's the sense that I'm getting right now. Huh. Whoa! Hmm. No. Because it's up there, right? And and I can see Grim, Grimhooks up there, right? So it's, it's doable. There is a way, just I'm not really seeing it. Hmm, that might be it. Okay, that's fine. Oh, come on. So let me get no oh wait, wait actually kinda. Okay, and it kind of drops me down here, but I don't think that's actually the goal. I think it's actually not supposed to do that. Hmm, okay, I think I'm seeing... Sorta. It's a little busted. No, I must be looking at this wrong. I have to be. But how could I be? That's clearly the path. Is there a way for me to jump down? Is there a hook down there? I think I see a hook. There is in fact a hook. Okay, so yes, I do need to make it there somehow. Confirmed. This is... So Wait. This is somehow the correct path. Could be that I have to shoot one of them first. Yep! That's it. Okay. Got it. Okay. I see. That's weird. But you know what? They, they did it. They, they made it work somehow. the fuck did I just end up now? Is this the start? Yeah, it's the start. Oh. Hmm. 
There's a certain angle where it likes it. Okay. No! Okay, I've got this. Ah! This is what happens when you take a platforming section that was originally designed for someone else and you go, okay, well, let's just make it work. You get a weird situation like this. This is a, ah, fuck it, ship it moment. Too early. Okay. And we did it. Oh my god! <laughs> Kill me! <laughs> I thought we did it. Why would that not be it? Why would you set it up so where the last one can fail? Mm. Oh, I get it. We're supposed to shoot that one first, too. Maybe it actually does work more than I'm than I'm giving it credit for. Because I'm not shooting them first, you know? Well, I'm shooting some of them first, but not all of them. No! My solace is knowing that this is not required. I can just do it the regular way with Nero, right? But this is about pride. Right, like, they, they, they don't make you do it in this busted way. There is another option. But fuck. I want pain! <laughs>
kill me! my fault. I was initially in this area, I was like, you know what, this is pretty clever how they've done this, but it doesn't work. <laughs> exhausting and again there's a way to just do it so yeah um, so at the second divinity statue he goes to the left then down Then he, cr then he takes a circuit around there. Huh, okay. That's quite a commitment. But alright, so when I see the second divinity statue, I will head out for, for there. Ah! Oh, that was crazy. Oh, that last bit was a little draining, to be honest. <laughs> I mean, I asked, I wonder how they made that bit work. Well, work might be a stretch. It's completable, <laughs> as we have clearly seen. I would not say it worked. I have fallen below, and I can't get up. Ah, 
My ass is lost now. Okay. It is actually just forward. I'm starting to realize that, like, since you can pop two of them while you're in Sin DT, there's actually no functional reason not to Sin DT when you want to use one of those moves. Like, at all. Like, there is no reason to do it. Like, you're straight- you're, since you can pull off at least two, you're essentially wasting one. Like, you can do two screen clears if you pop it. So, really, I'm- I think I'm- DT is the part that I'm- I'm- I don't want to say screwing up on, but it's the part that I'm- I need to optimize more. Uh, on the plus side, this is where the next orb fragment is, so that's good. Oh yeah, let's uh, let's go up here. But yeah, because I'm, like I'm thinking, like if if you can get three of those moves into a Sin DT, there's no reason, or sorry, if you can get two of them in, there's no reason to not do that. <laughs> a very pointless buy, to be honest. But I bought it. So down below. Yeah. I should be Sin DTing a lot more. Uh, yeah, actually, I do want to go up now that I think about it, because this circuit brings me to the blue orb. Yeah, you get two free. Because you can follow one up with another immediately. Oh, the, oh, it didn't do enough damage on the first one? Fuck you. I got another. Might even be able to chain three if you just use your whole thing for that. But, I mean, at that point, I'm not using my, my Sin DT, so, you know. Might want to optimize a little more than that. Get some... Yeah! 
Get some extra functionality out of it. Okay, so what's next? So he runs up there. Mission 16, okay. So at the head of the big pit, Dante's gonna drop down there. He's gonna go, is he gonna go all the way to the bottom? He's gonna go all the way to the bottom, got it. He's gonna go all the way to the bottom. And then when he's done fighting those guys, he's gonna run down here again. And I don't think he's gonna drop all the way to the bottom. No, wait, maybe he is. And he fights them. Okay, well, let, let's worry about this in a bit, because that's, that's a ways away from now. Okay. Oh, you're not a problem at all. I thought you were big potatoes, but you can't even stand up to the straight swords. Chicken boy! Or lady. I'm actually not sure. It's been a while. Alright. Okay. I remember not liking you as a boss. Okay, I still got damage. Woo! <laughs> Didn't even mean to do that. Wow, yeah, you can actually fit all three screen clears into one Sin DT. 
Is... Is Virgil OP? <laughs> is, is he actually too strong? He can do three screen clears in a row. That's... That's a lot. That's... That's a lot. Like that, That's three screen clears in a row. Ah, shit. There was a lot of extra DT on the way. Yeah, there we go. So I want to go through here, and then I want to clear the next room, too. That's a great combo. Ah! Oh, that's fine. I hit him. Okay, so the the next orb was around here. So if I'm not mistaken, so they drop down there. They end up where we're at now. They actually go further in across this little platform here. I need to stay on the top, go around eventually come to a hole and are we dropping all the way down it looks like we're dropping all the way down okay and then there's another fight so let's just let's just keep going Uh, 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 that's fine.
Okay, so here's the thing. Yes, you can do three of them, but it's not free. You still have to build concentration. Yeah, it's not. It's not free. It's not free. You you still have to build to at least two. I kind of think for three screen clearers though, maybe it should be three. It should be, you should have to build it to full, not like you know. I'm just thinking out loud. It just seems a little wow. Uh, okay, so then after that. After this room goes in there, he drops down again, he goes all the way to the bottom, he drops again, he goes all the way to the bottom. Huh. Okay, but of course it's across a chasm, so we'll have to see what we can do. Okay, yeah, I can't fall on this, so... Fine. Uh oh, there's more than one. I actually meant to use Cindy T, but whatever. And next up, we're going to drop again. And down we go. And I'm going to say yes. Okay. So, but how? Uh, how no, actually, that's a really good question. How the fuck? If I wall bound, no, not even close, actually. That feels like you must have to do it as Dante. There's no way. You couldn't possibly do that. Not with Virgil. Only the thing had come out. Once again, I can't stand these levels where they're like, you shouldn't have the music that you, like, listen to every day on your phone for months because of how fucking cool it is. You shouldn't have that. Uh. 
Dude, if I even got like one more. Oh shit, wait, I just realized I should have watched the video, made the video go next. Oh god. Mission 16, replay from the start. For secret mission number 12. I okay. Give me a minute. I'm gonna write down the orbs that I didn't get so that I can get them easily later. You know? Uh let me okay, so let me put a note in my phone. Um fucking mission. 16, and, no, wait, yeah, mission 16, because I don't want to fucking forget where, what I did and didn't get, and mission whatever has the lava falls. There. So that I, I know where to get the orbs later, so that I don't... <sighs> okay, so, so I'm not going to be getting that one. So that's in mission 16. Uh, and now for purple fragment number 8. Jesus! Why did they make it like this? Yeah, of course. Dante, Dante, Dante. Okay, but what's the next one I can get, please? Okay. Um, so that is then... So now, now we don't have to worry until mission 18. Got it. Are we fighting Cerberus? Is it time? Time for Pupper? It might be time for Bumper. It might be time for Bumper. Um. Not mean to come back in there. Oh. Hey, big boy. Who's a good boy? Moving back, whoa! Oh my! Okay, you have to be off.
Ah! Yeah, if you build those up, it's it's done. But but again, now now that I'm now that I'm 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 seeing it, like you gotta put in some work to get those in, you know? <laughs> like yeah, you can blow them apart if you get that. But you have to you have to you have to hang back. You have to build. You have to concentrate. You have to hang in for a major payoff. Yeah, yeah, I'm seeing it. I'm seeing it. Oh shit. Time to figure out Urizen, boys. Time to figure out Urizen. My... I think I'm mid teleport, so I'm kind of safe. Yo.
Okay, uh, so for fragment 32, let me just take a look. Where is the next one? Oh, apparently this is the last one. So after this, it'll just be, do be doing cleanup on other levels off stream. So no more orb hunting. Uh, but yeah, let me grasp where this is. So from there, there's a little area that you can jump. Yeah, I remember this spot. And then from there, he goes... Yeah, I don't care about the fighting. Okay. That seems simple enough. Okay. Oh wow, a real cutscene! <laughs> it's been a while! I'm gonna have so much catching up to do today, uh, from today, uh, when I get it, when I when I actually end this stream, which will presumably be when I beat the last boss. where I'm heading up there. I wonder if the same principle applies, because in the in the main game, when you fought these guys, they only had as many moves as you bought for V, so if you actually bought everything, the fights were harder. 
But I've bought nothing for V because I haven't played V yet. Not in this version, at least. And that's the last blue orb on the list. I'll have to do cleanup on the ones I missed, presumably with the other characters. So, you know, I wouldn't, I'm, so we're not going to worry about that. But, uh, yeah. I'm just going to repost the stream links because we're closing in on the final bosses. doesn't seem like that's that's in play here because they've got some moves so I definitely would have had to buy oh Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm stunned! I've never seen that!
Huh. Oh man, I think I think this next fight might actually give me some trouble. Cause fuck. That's not going to be enough. Shit. Is this it? This is the final boss. Well, <laughs> in this area. This is the final boss of this level. Oh, I'm, I'm going to die once. I'll tell you that much. With this health? Hell yeah. Hey, you want me to want me to do some bullshit on these guys? Watch this. Ow, I teleported into the hitbox. Get back. That's fine. Are they both dead? No. He's dead. Okay, it's time. Dude, uh, it's about to get crazy. Okay. Yeah! <laughs> Holy shit. you, Ruben, and your conspiracy theories. No, Ruben, COVID is not a hoax. Yeah, he really thinks that. <laughs>
Guarded me. That's so cool. Oh my god. Oh. Fuck. Holy shit. Go. Yeah! Let's kick Dante's ass! So I've been told that the final bosses are Dante and Dante for real. <laughs> so this isn't even him at his toughest. Uh, not really. Oh boy. Fuck! 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 Teleported right into him. Again! Mm. Woo! Ow! Oh god! Dante! Ah! Oh! Oh, this is so good! Oh, no. 
I didn't even mean to do that, but that's fine. trip I can't even get him to 50! Ah!
Oh boy. Dante has a vast arsenal of attacks. Brute strength will not be enough to defeat him. Remember what you've learned and deal with each attack as it comes. Fuck. <laughs> that, that's advice, huh? Okay. <laughs> Oh, not far enough. I walked right into that. Oh, I thought I tricked out. I tricked in. It's different. Okay, you know what? I'm starting to learn it though. Starting to learn. I agree, Dante. Do it again. Oh, 
Yeah, I thought maybe I could power through it, but that's not gonna happen. He doesn't work like that. There's no- I'm not gonna be getting any charges on that, I have to stop trying. That was bad. I walked into that again. Oh! I felt that. Whoa! Oh! <laughs> Is this useful at all in this fight? I feel like it could be. Okay, you can dodge the Royal Guard.
He dodged it. <laughs> yeah, I definitely did not mean to do that without popping uh, my fucking DT. That was not on purpose. That's fine, you got me. Ruben, let me strangle the life from you. In those sw roughing switches. Teleporter right into it again. I gotta stop doing that. Ah. That was stupid. Oh, 
That's fine, you know what? That's that's good. That's progress. I like that. He's very weak to the to the to, to kick thirteen. If you can get Sin DT kick thirteen rolling, he, he can't do a lot against that. That that shit counters his moves like crazy. Why? The way he caught me on that. Now, Dante for real. Wait, they're using this cutscene. Or at least part of it. It's my son. Yeah, dumbass. Well, I would assume that I would fight Nero next, but and that's what this cutscene makes it look like, but I know you fight Dante again. Well, well. That was a long time ago. 
I guess you were young once too. As much as I'd love to hear that story, I think it's about time we ended this. Are they gonna cut the cut the cutscene before the moment? Yeah, they are. Yeah, okay. Oh, let's fucking go! Dante for real. Oh, Dante for real. Oh, fuck! Let's go! Oh boy, Dante's got fucking everything he has in this game now. Oh boy. Dude, I'm so hype right now. Oh, he's, he's kind of like... Yeah, he's, he's just hanging out over there. Oh, boy. Sin Devil Trigger Dante is a fearsome foe. One you cannot afford, hope to, avoid, to beat just by evading his attacks. Summon your courage on your own. Own Sin Devil Trigger and hold nothing back. Holy shit. Smashing circle to try and get out. I just kind of sit there and took it. That's my fault. Mm. 
Ugh, it comes out so much faster than I always think it does. Oh my god! Did you trick me? Yeah, you kind of tricked me. Can he aim that up? Oh, well, you can aim it straight forward, that's for sure. Yeah, he can't shoot up. Okay. I am the drizzle that is approaching. Stop. 
Never mind, he can shoot up. Oh no, I just dropped it for no reason. That's fine. Mm. 
Yeah, I know. Oh! Okay. Dude, I don't even mind losing to this. This is incredible.
Oh! That's fine. I walked right into that. Now you're done. Not quite yet. Fuck you. Ah. Adios. Where the fuck are you going? <laughs> Oh, Nero's here. Hold on to that until then. Oh, we're, we're just back to the, the original ending. So if we're back to the original ending, are we seeing more that we didn't see before? Is that what's going on here? Wow, this thing got real big. You trying to compensate for something? Yes, the iron of competence. By the way, how'd it feel catching up with your kid there's no need for us to catch up yeah, this is new well with an attitude like that you're never gonna meet your grandkids that's enough Ooh. i don't want to hear it now don't get in my way took the words right out of my mouth <sighs> <sighs> Thus brothers joined to face the tree, but time rekindles rivalry. Dante. I'm up one. Where did you 
learn to count. We're even. Come on. You know I was always better with the numbers. Not so much. That's any. Dare say it. <laughs> Wait, we're going past you it? Leave me hanging? We used to love saying that. I have no recollection. <laughs> well, let me jog your memory. A little Virgil. <laughs> Crying in the corner. Because mommy got mad. <laughs> Big old boy. I seem to recall you crying every time father raised his voice. <laughs> How would they feel if they saw us now? What does it matter? We're still here, aren't we? Yeah, you're probably right. <laughs> That was perfect. <laughs> that, how long was that going? Like eight hours? That was the most fun I have had with this video game. By far. And I love the original. I love it. Uh, uh, the original. I love the other part of the game a lot. Hey, that's, that's really cool. That's, that's really nice. Also looks really pretty in HDR. Cool. Sun of Sparta. Blood Palace. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow, that was the most fun I have had with Devil May Cry 5. That was, I, I fucking loved that. That, that final, I don't even just mean the final two fights. Those were perfect. They might even be beyond perfect. But like, even just the experience of everything that Virgil does and the way that he plays. And I, I mean, I played him before, right? But that. The, uh, I haven't played him actively, and that was absolutely phenomenal.
I cannot even imagine going through this uh, on like something like Legendary Dark Knight. Um, God. Wow. Holy shit. Okay. It's 9 o'clock. I think I started streaming at noon. Um, that's like 9 hours. I should definitely go catch up on everything I missed today. So yeah. Have a good one. Bye-bye.